<laughs> Sorry for wanting to leave so quickly. It was getting too hectic for me. No, no, it's fine to be honest. I was getting sick of listening to Mr. Feckler. What a pleasure it is to see you all through a different perspective after 10 long years. That's good. <laughs> I don't think anyone could do that man's voice justice. Oh, sorry, but was that supposed to be a reunion? It felt more like one of those boring ass assemblies on a Monday morning trying not to piss about or fall asleep. Yeah, weird, isn't it? <laughs> what? I don't know, it's hard to explain. When you're young, you see something every day for years, and then you see it again, and you get all butterflies. In your stomach. Yeah, I know what you mean. Hey, thank God I didn't bow to Fekla. You know, I don't think he ever liked me during school. What makes you say that? Always scowling at me. Never approving my fashion sense. You never wore the proper uniform. What can I say? I wanted to stand out. <laughs> he was the reason I skived every now and then. Then there was Michael Intrish. Oh my god! Michael fucking Intrish! Oh! Did you see him at the reunion? Trying to infest the three members of the staff and he's got awful Kevin Hart impression. Oh! Just embarrassing! And slightly racist! It's strange. What is? <laughs> you? <laughs> and Thackler and Intrish? Were the only people I recognised when I walked in. Goes to show how far moved on from it all, I suppose. You're not the only one. You recognise more than me! There was that like little group that you like wandered off with. Oh, my boys. Oh. The rest were too trivial for you and me. <laughs> oh, interest. Oh. Remember that dance you did during lunch break? Oh my god, the um. The slag penetrator. <laughs> Fuck it, Al. I remember a girl who tried doing that too once. You remember? Oh, the slap she gave him. You can hear it a mile off. He's always been a bit of an oddball. Ghost shows that he's desperate. For what? Companionship? Young lads tend to do stupid things in the hopes of getting or at least impressing a girl. Take off your psychotherapy cap, thank you. Hmm. Something I notice is all. I'm surprised I can remember him. He definitely remembered you. I thought you was gonna get the full-on slag penetrator. <laughs> like, seriously though, like, I kept my distance from everyone. I don't know. It felt really... <laughs> Ominous to me? Don't worry about it. It's only school. Still, it kind of gives you a shitty feeling. Well, I recognise you the moment you walk around the corner. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> you certainly know how to make an entrance. What is that supposed to mean? No one in that hall appreciated your beautiful work. So much emotion conveyed in footsteps alone. <laughs> Okay, Shakespeare. <laughs> Calm down. Oh. Hey, one thing I don't miss. The fights. Nuisance. Always on this field. It was a perfect spot for a scrap and enough space for the whole school to go legging it over and watch. They were never that violent either. What do you consider violent? Um, let me think. Really Otter from Goodfellas when he approached his wife's friend and pounds the butt of the gun in his face. A little overkill. <laughs> I watched it one night and I thought, wow. The fights at school have got nothing on this. This, however, I have missed a lot. Yeah. Are you all right? Yeah. Missed you. Okay. Come on then. We spent enough time looking back on Good, bad and shit ugly days. We haven't told me what you've been doing. I've got a teaching job in Rotherham. That's great. Yeah, I'm teaching physics. The only confused, twatted, shabby kids trying to fill their hollow heads with nonsense. <laughs> Can be a right ball, eh? That's pretty much it. What about you? Wait, that can't be the only thing you've been doing. Well, there was obviously college, uni. No, I meant like... No other person in the picture? Right now, uh -huh. at this precise moment, not yet. Oh. What have you been doing? Well, you know about my psychotherapy skills? <laughs> mm hmm. Mostly been working at Sheffield, living 
the dream. <laughs> That's good. Actually, there's someone else. What? What was that, Brandon? What the fuck? Why did you do that? Was that too quick? No, just what was that? I thought, shit, I thought. Oh, what? Did I hurt you? No, just I, what the fuck was that? I wanted it to. I wanted it to feel right. Feel right? I'm in love with you. Oh, Jesus Christ, Bradley. I have been since the day I met you. Never told you about it because I was such a faggot. Bradley. Just stop, Please. Bradley. No, stop! I'm engaged. That's hardly obvious, is it? Why not tell me earlier? Please, Jack. No, stop! She'll be here any minute. She? Her name's Tina. Oh. We're getting married in a few months. Yeah. I wanted to tell you sooner, but it was the wrong time. And school thing, it was chaotic and interest, like making it weird and... Weird, yeah. Don't be upset. I'm not upset. Be honest with me. How long? We've been engaged for about... No, 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 I mean, how long have you known about... God, since I was, like, 16? 12 years. I didn't tell my parents till I left uni. I think I'm gonna go. No, stay. It was lovely seeing you. Congratulations on your engagement. Buddy, stop. You knew all this time, yet you still led me on. Just wait a fucking minute. Why are you being such a knob? Will you sit down? Buddy, you can't leave like this. <sighs> Oi. What? You say you've been in love with me since the day you met me. Was the only reason I started hanging out with you. Oh, great. Till I realised how kind, funny and caring you were. Mm. And still are. We were never really friends then. Oh, of course we were, I'm just saying. Oh, I see what you're saying. I just never thought for a second that you were, you know. Most people didn't. You're too pretty. Oh, excuse me? Oh shit, sorry, that shouldn't have come out. This is all just weird. Look, I'm sorry, okay? Oh, I can treat you well. I'd be normal for you. What did you just say? Be sure you don't want this. Who's that? Tina. Tina? I wanted you to meet her. It was meant to be a surprise, but... I don't want to talk to her. We're adults now, Bradley. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Is Wesley still down there? What? Remember when we used to nick monster drinks and like it back up here? I never took you for a thief. Hey. This is Bradley. Hi. Hello. <laughs> I'm not ruining anything, am I? Nope. Mm. So this is the famous tree stump that you've been rambling about? Yeah. It's actually kind of weird you've been there. Yeah, weird. Well, do you maybe want to sit down? Yeah. Really? I mean, if you want to. Why not? My mum was furious when she found out. Who told her? School. Got my bollock in from them. And I got a bollock in from my mum. And I got an even bigger bollock from the guy in the shop. Just like a full day of just like bollocks to the face. <laughs> Lovely image. 
Ruined our tradition, didn't they, Brad? Mm. I'm still not sure I love it so much. What do you mean? It's just a stump. It's not just a stump. But a dead wood. <laughs> Holds memories. Right. She feels comfortable here. Sorry? I did. Through school, he used to bring me out here to the tree stump. Make me feel better and help calm me down. In fact, he was the only one who was nice to me. Showed respect. Something to take note of in case she wanted to bring her down here or something. I don't know. I'll keep that in mind. So, did you, um, did you tell him? I did, yeah. And? I don't think I'll be able to make it. I didn't tell you the date. It's getting late, I should get going. Okay, well, it was nice to meet you. See you soon, maybe? Maybe. Anyways, I'll leave you two to do whatever it is that you people do. <laughs> people? Mm. Was that supposed to mean something? Mm. Excuse me, what you just said, what, what was that supposed to mean? What? What, you're both lesbos, aren't you? <laughs> Gladly. Oh, what is it you think we do? Kiss, hold hands, touch boobs, summon demons, I don't know. Oh my god, summon demons, come on. Do you kids are gonna make a fire? Funny. Well, at least I've got a sense of humour. You're the one being weird. How am I the weird one? Oh, sorry, sorry. I meant to say twat. Hey, enough. <laughs> can see who's a bloke in this relationship. Okay, enough. Let's go. No, it's fine, actually, I, I'm loving this. Please. Keep going. Your girlfriend's a liar. Is she now? Just up? stop it. Flirting me all through school, making me feel like she likes me. You're my friend. Then today she tells me the truth, what she is. Oh. And you say that like it's a problem. You've been into her since school. That's a bit fucking weird, isn't it? Not really. She kind of is. Explain. You've got attachment issues, mate. Thanks. Not a compliment. Prick. Guys, calm down. No, oh, sorry. No. What makes you think you could just make a comment like that and walk away? Who the fuck do you think you are? Let me guess you proposed, yeah? <laughs> so? <laughs> Look at us standing there doing nothing. What am I supposed to do? At least act like you care. Care about what? You being disrespectful? This is what you want, is it? The fuck is this problem? People are gonna judge you day in, day out, call you every name under the sun. You're gonna get this shit kicked out of you because you're with her. A woman who, by the way, doesn't know you like I do. So, if that's what you want, after everything I've done, then fuck you. Okay, well, I see what's going on here. Do you? Yes, I do. What's so that? you don't like the way we are, I suggest you turn around and you fuck off. I was going. Go on then. I will. Bye. <laughs> Come on. My friend's made a bet, you know. My God. <laughs> a bet to see how quick I could. Yeah, how quick I could. Could what? Shagger? Yeah. Oh, God. And you know what's worse? I agreed to it. And if I'd have won, I'd have got a tenner. A tenner? Fucking hell, that is a lot of money. Did that persuade you? No, I stopped it out of guilt, though. I wonder if I'd have gone through with it, maybe you won't be the way you are now. Oh, I'm gonna fuck it! I just think it's a shame! Oh! You're making me feel sick! I feel sorry for you. I don't want your pity. Goodbye, Bradley. You might want to wear your ring. Something to think about. Are we okay? Yeah. Yeah. You ready to go? I'm gonna stay for a bit. Can I catch you up?
Thank <laughs> you.